beautiful souls. Thank you for joining me for another 444 meditation. I love you all so much. Thank you for being here. For today's video, we're going to do three different powerful exercises that will lead us to a deep meditation. We're going to start with the breath of fire, and we're going to do some body energe energetic scanning, and then we're going to end it with a sound bath. But first, let's just wait for a few more people to show up. Hello, Catherine, Andrea, welcome. <laughs> Another beautiful Friday, TGIF. How is everyone doing? Oli, Daniel, welcome. Hmm. This whole week I've been meditating a lot, so when I close my eyes, I can really just fly out. Right? Hmm. So even in just like this, I already feel so relaxed. This whole week just led me to more and more meditation. Hi Christian. Hi guys, thank you. Beautiful. <laughs> Loretto. Oh, someone just sent an angry face. That's weird. Alright, so for today's meditation, we're going to start with the breath of fire. So, the breath of fire is a very powerful exercise that you can do every day. Um, it helps activate your solar plexus, your navel, it increases your immunity. And it, with different postures and mudras, you can actually use it to raise your kundalini energy up towards the crown as well, opening your third eye and your crown area. Okay, so we will start with that and then we will follow it with a breathing exercise that you're going to do to balance the energy within your body and energy field. Okay, and then we're going to end it with a sound bath with the Linga Mudra, which is your left thumb up. And then you're just gonna bring the fingers or the hands together with the left thumb up. And this helps strengthen your, your, pelvic, um, your pelvic bone and it helps strengthen your connection to your root chakra and your sacral, okay? So we will do those three things. So to begin the practice, come into a seated position. And just bring your palms up on top of your knees, palms are open. And we'll begin by breathing deeply, slow inhale and exhale through the nose. Inhale, exhale. You can exhale through the mouth as well if that feels more comfortable. You can also set your intention at this time. So we will begin the first Kriya. We're going to do the breath of fire. So bring your thumbs up, fingers in, and just raise it as high as you can in a V position. Shoulders relax, eyes are closed, and you're going to start pumping the breath out through the nose as fast as you can, and as you exhale, your navel naturally goes in. So it's going to look like this. Okay, so when you're ready, bring the thumbs up, fingers in, and start the breath.
keep going, keep pumping the navel, keep stretching the arms, keep breathing, just 30 more seconds. Take a deep breath in, hold this breath, squeeze your navel, bring the thumbs together above your head, stretch, spread the fingers, and as you exhale, release your hands above your knees, and just come back to the breath, inhale and exhale. Notice the energetic shift from outside of you, from within you. This automatically raises your vibration, creates heat in your body. And just feel all of that. Another deep breath in, exhale. So the next part, we're just going to scan our body. Bring your palms facing yourself, your body, and as you inhale, you raise your hands up. And as you exhale, you bring it down very slowly. Inhale, you can bring your palms up and exhale down. Deep breathing, exhale. This is a very simple, energetic breathing, cleansing and purifying your aura. And you will, you may notice where there's blockages by scanning your body. So it can be in any parts of your, your chakra. And know that as you do this, you're clearing all the blockages. So just feel it up. Close your eyes. Bring the palms up and down. As slow as you can. Go as high as you feel and as low as you need to. This is a simple exercise that you can do every morning before you get out of your bed, just making sure your energy is balanced. Also do this when you're feeling anxious or angry or sad. And this will help balance out the energy. Let's do three more. Last one, inhale up. And exhale, release. Okay, just ground yourself. Hands on top of your knees. Continue breathing. Last breath in. Exhale. 
exhale. So the final Kriya, you're going to interlace your fingers and you're going to bring your left thumb up. Okay, left thumb up, Linga Mudra. Squeeze the, nav the navel and the elbows in, shoulders relaxed. And just breathe here. This is going to bring all the power into the sacral and the, and the root chakra, the bottom of your spine. It's going to increase your creativity, your sexuality, and it's going to ground you. So just feel this. Stay here and breathe. This is the final mudra. Squeezing the palms together, left thumb up. I'm going to play the same bowl while you do that. So feel free to just stay in that position. And just breathe. As well, activate that peace, that light that is always within. back to the body, you can release your hands, begin to move your body in any way that feels nice. Bring the hands together in front of the heart. And we're going to end our meditation with the long time sun. Feel free to join. This is a blessing for your soul. Inhale. 
Inhale to begin. May the long time sun shine upon you. All love surround you. And a pure light within you. Guide your way on. May the long time sun shine upon you. All love surround you, and a pure light within you guide your way on, guide your way on, guide your way. Take a deep breath in and exhale, bowing your head, namaste, release your hands, thank you beautiful soul for joining me once again, thank you for receiving the light, for activating the light and being the light, thank you for existing at this time, at this space, and this reality. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Namaste. Take as much time as you need to come back into your body. Breathe. Move. Be happy. Yay! <laughs>